Hey YouTube, Jeep and Bubba here at Black Bear Off-Road and I have been meaning to for quite a while introduce you to the uh, Nissan Pathfinder. I don't think I've ever done that so you might have seen it around but here it is. This is my 1995 Nissan Pathfinder. It has a factory V6. I think it's a 3 liter and uh, it's a 5 speed manual 4x4. This particular vehicle was owned by a uh, drift guy I think somebody and before before it was owned by my buddy John Woolley at S3 magazine so Woolley bought this thing and it has a three and a half inch lift and 33 inch tires those are Volk TE I don't remember the number 33 what kind of wheels are these TE 33s Kyle always knows the number um, but yeah it had a wrap that said CRC right here and then in, in like um, Japanese letters it said speed style of sound for S3 magazine I took that off put a black bear off-road windshield banner that actually looks like the Nismo lettering and then even though Brandon doesn't like this Brandon Cordell I don't care I do like this for a little red visor. It's got the Salvania lights. We added a Black Bear off-road tag and then I upgraded the headlights. Factory looking style housings, but we did um, some LEDs from Dynamic Sound and was missing the factory style fog lights and we put some LEDs in there as well and they look good. They work well at night. And there's a switch for those fogs and it runs the orange ones as well um it's got some mud flaps it's got some dents and some dings but uh it's classy we added the s3 decals on there took off a lot of the stickers that woolly had on there uh but he was okay with that he told us he did not mind it is a four door i don't know if you guys ever noticed but these are four doors the door kind of blends in i do eventually plan to tent this all right here because I want it to look like all like one solid window basically the seats fold down and it works really well to haul stuff I use it all the time for that um, kind of daily driver and I haven't had to do much with it. a couple of things like um, belts and pulleys and uh, I think we had to do an alternator on it yeah an alternator it has a grip royal steering wheel and it has an old school steel hood shift knob uh old touchscreen radio kind of old school but it's got some nice speakers some nice alpine speakers in it um and besides my like cheese it's bags it's uh got a really clean nice interior crack dash but it's like a champagne tan color and my favorite thing on it is obviously the bronze wheels the bronze volks they're probably worth about as much as the body on this thing um but four-wheel drive works good. We've wheeled it. In fact, it's been in some of our YouTube videos um, with it being wheeled. And we kind of want to plan a anything but Jeeps ride sometime. Not that I'm against Jeeps, but uh, I just thought it'd be cool to take out some guys that are in, like, I don't know, Saddlebrook's F-150 or, um, you know, some of my guys that ride stuff like a Lexus GX or what have you. Take those out and just do an anything but kind of jeeps ride and do something you know light and easy maybe we need to bring a jeep buddy in case we get stuck but that's it it did have this yokohama wrap before and uh, we just kept those on there those are the yokohama mts 33s and 17 inch wheels if you have any questions let me know and we're going to be posting on instagram i found pathfinder bubba so you can check out this vehicle on pathfinder bubba i haven't posted a lot but I just wanted to introduce you guys to this and just a short little fun video here on Friday. We're going to get back to the trails this weekend and shoot some video coverage of uh, some trails on the west side of the state that are part of the Traverse and do some exploring out there. Just wanted to give you guys a short little video. Hope you're having a good weekend. It is Memorial Day weekend and just want to say thank you to all of the uh, families who have had uh, soldiers died overseas that made that sacrifice for us and we do take our hats off for those who have passed We will be closed over Memorial Day weekend and uh, Absolutely, uh, we're thankful for 
the men who have died that have given us the freedoms that we have here in this country. So I hope there's an adventure in your future. I'm Jeep and Bubba. Eat your prunes. We'll be seeing you.